Hey guys, this is Sam, and this is my step-by-step -step guide on how to jailbreak iOS 9. Step 1. Make sure you head over to iTunes and do a full backup of your device through iTunes so just in case anything would go wrong during the jailbreak process, it likely won't, but just in case you would have a full backup of all of your personal data. So make sure you do that first. Step two, after you've backed up your device through iTunes, you wanna head over to your web browser and type in en.pangu.io, or you can even head over to my website, iupdateos.com download in order to download the iOS 9.0 through 9.0.2 untethered Pangu jailbreak utility. Step three, once the jailbreak utility has finished downloading, go ahead and locate it on your computer and then double click to open it. If you get a pop-up like this, just click run or OK, and then you're going to see a screen that looks like this. Step 4. Now head back over to your iOS device, and we have to turn a few things off just so that the jailbreak works properly. First, we want to head over to the Settings app and disable Find My iPhone if we have that turned on or make sure iCloud is turned off entirely, as well as making sure that we do not have a passcode set on our device. Both of these things can cause some issues with the jailbreak. Also, we do want to put our device into airplane mode, so just swipe up on control center and tap on the airplane icon. Step five, now head back over to your PC and go ahead and click right there on the start button. It's going to give us one last warning to make sure we have find my iPhone turned off, airplane mode on, no passcode set up, as well as making sure that we have once again done a full backup of our device. And since we've done all those things, go ahead and once again, once again click on the start button and the jailbreak process will begin. Now keep in mind that as the jailbreak tool is running, you don't really want to mess with your device whatsoever. There's a few interactive parts that I'll be talking about in just a second where it actually does require you to unlock your device and tap on a few things, but we'll get to those in just a second. Just make sure to not touch your device and let the jailbreak run. Step six, at about 65% of the way through the jailbreak process, you're going to see a pop-up on screen that says, please unlock the device and enable airplane mode again. So this is okay for you to touch your device, just swipe up on control center, or even go to the settings app and make sure to once again, re-enable airplane mode. So it'll look just like this. Step seven, at about 75% of the way through, you're going to see a pop-up that says now, once again, go ahead and unlock your device and then find the Pangu looking app installed on your home screen. So you just wanna tap on that. This is where it gets a little weird. It now tells us to go ahead and give Pangu the okay to see our photos or have access to our photos, which I'm not exactly sure what this is all about. It, I don't, I, I doubt that it's malicious, but it's still kind of one of those things where it's like, well, why would they need access to my photo library or to my photos at all? But in order for the jailbreak to proceed, you need to go ahead and click allow. That's definitely going to be a judgment call on your part. Step eight. In just a few minutes later, your device will be successfully jailbroken and you can go ahead and close out of the Pangu app on your computer. Now head over to your iOS device, slide to unlock, and tap on the Cydia icon in your home screen. It'll take just a few minutes to prepare the file resources. Step nine, after Cydia is done doing its thing, go ahead and after your device is restarted, slide to unlock and then go back to the Cydia icon once again and congratulations, you have successfully jailbroken iOS 9.0 through 9.0.2 on your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. In case you haven't already, make sure you go ahead and click on that subscribe button down below just so you don't miss out on any of my future uploads because we're going to be talking a lot about jailbreak tweaks throughout the next couple of days. And if you enjoyed watching this video, feel free to drop a like and let me know what you think about this jailbreak by leaving a comment down below. This has been Sam with iUpdateOS, happy jailbreak day, and I will talk to you in the next one.